Greetings from the Panchester. Do you know that air pollution kills 7 million people worldwide every year? Why would you know? Because nowadays, no one talks about air pollution on news channels. But today, I, Prithviraj Manish Singh, along with my team, the Panchastra, a group of five environmentally conscious tech anthos from Bill Avishwakama Mahavidyalaya First Year Electronics and Communication Department, are here to brief you with our project. Our project is an IoT based air monitoring system. This here, our device, will tell you that you are taking away your own precious time of your own life. First, MQ-135 sensor. It is an air quality sensor used for detecting a wide range of gases including NH3, NOx, alcohol, benzene, smoke and CO2. Ideal for use in office or factory, MQ-135 gas sensor has high sensitivity to ammonia, sulfide and benzene steam and also is sensitive to smoke and other harmful gases. It is with low cost and particularly therefore is suitable for air quality monitoring system application. The second sensor used is DHT-11. It is a single wire digital humidity and temperature sensor which provides humidity and temperature values serially with one wire protocol. It provides relative humidity value in percentage ranging from 20 to 90 percent and temperature values in degrees Celsius from 0 to 50 degrees Celsius. DHT11 sensor uses resistive humidity measurement component and NTC temperature measurement component. The microcontroller board we have used is Node MCU ESP8266, which is an open source software and hardware development environment built around an inexpensive system on a chip called ESP8266, which is designed and manufactured by Expressive Systems and contains the crucial elements of a computer, which are CPU, RAM, networking that is Wi Fi, and even a modern, modern operating system and SDK. This makes it an excellent choice for the Internet of Things that is IoT projects of all kinds. The microcontroller is programmed in MicroPython, which is a lean and efficient implementation of the Python 3 programming language that includes a small subset of the Python standard libraries and is optimized to run on microcontrollers and its unconstrained environments. It is compact enough to fit and run within just 256KB of code space and 16KB of RAM. Okay. For this project, we have taken input from the analog pin of MQ-135 sensor into ADC pin on our board. It returns a value from 0 to 1024. The higher the value, the poorer the quality of air. In this demonstration video, we will show how the value of MQ-135 sensor changes as the air quality changes. We use a transparent glass container, paper and matchsticks. Set the paper to fire and place it under the inverted glass along with the sensor. Since the container is closed, flame dies out due to lack of oxygen and smoke starts accumulating. The changes in the PPM values and air quality index can be seen on the LCD screen as well as the graph. This technology is proposed to enhance the nature of air. Utilizing of MQ-135 gas sensor, it gives the amount of various kind of perilous gases and node MCU is the core of this undertaking which control the whole procedure. Wi-Fi module associates the entire process, entire procedure to web and the results are shown on the web page. The future scopes of this project, uh, this could be further improved by designing for global server and designing apps for the apps for the real-time monitoring. To make more advancements by testing the gas sensor with harmful gases and to portray the constituents of the gases. This could be further improved by applying some machine learning algorithms on the data we collected from the air 
for the data visualization thank you